Maths with Niall. Today we're doing tallying. Hi Niall. Yes, today we're learning how to do tally. So we've got a tally chart behind you that you'll be filling out. Can you tell us what information you have over there in those balls? So I have asked loads of people, well we'll pretend people, their favourite colours. Can you lift up the ball and just have to give us a look? Okay, so you've got all the results in that ball. Yes, we've got green, orange, red, purple, blue. So people's favourite colours. Yeah. Okay, so let's have a look and see how we'll put the information on your tally chart. Yeah. So do you want to start? Okay, so our first colour is going to be red. So I'll scrunch all that into a, a ball and then we'll put it in this bowl. Okay, so you put it in an empty bowl. Yes. So red, what are you going to do with that red now? Now we have to put one for red. One stroke. Yeah, okay, one stroke. Now I'm taking orange. Scrunch all that up into a ball. Green. So why are you scrunching it up? Can you explain why? So I don't get mixed up in case like in case I make a mistake by putting one that I've already done back into here okay, and I haven't done anything so I might do it over. Okay, if you like to explain then. You don't have to close your eyes, just take them out. I'm doing it randomly. Okay, what colour is that? Purple. Okay, drop it in. So every time you pick one colour, you put in one stroke. Yeah. Right, so how many red do you have so far? Three. Three. What is it? Oh, red. Red. Okay, so let's discuss this for a minute. So put it in. So you've got four reds so far, so one more would make it how many? Five. Okay, but there's a specific way that we write five when we do a tally. Can you show us? Okay, we put one stroke across the previous yes. four. So that means we have five reds. Okay, yes. continue. Purple. So how many purples do you have up there so far? Four, so, so now five. Okay, so remind us again what you did for five. You have to put a line across. Very good. Blue. You can't see what you're doing. I'm going to put a line across. Green, line across, green again, one. Red. Can you stand to the side and explain now the red? Now we have to put another line across. So we have how many lots of five do we have now? Two. Very good.
only three greens left. So. Okay, so three greens. So one, two, three. Let's scratch your rock. Okay. Okay, great. So let's work out how many of each you have. Is it easy for you to see the amounts by how you've grouped them? Yeah. Okay, so can you explain the purple? Six. Um, six because five and one. Okay, good. So can you write six in the total column? Six. Okay. Then the green? Um, ten, eleven. Yes. So bring it down a bit, bring it up. Okay, that's fine. You'd have been green, and how many blue? Eight. Okay, that's fine. So do your eight. Orange. Four. Four. And red. Ten. Ten. Can you explain how you know it's mm -hmm. ten? Because five and five. Two to five. five. Okay, stand to the side and I'll ask you some questions. Yeah. Okay. So which colour is the most popular? Green. And how many people preferred green? Eleven. Okay, good. Which colour was the least popular? Orange. Orange. And how many people preferred orange? Four. Four. And how many more people preferred red than blue? Mm. Two. Two, because red has... Ten. Ten, and blue has... Eight. Okay, so Eight two more people. Two Very good. One last question, Niall. Can you explain first how you're going to do this? How can you work out how many people that you've asked all together? Well, we can just add the fives together first and then the ones. Oh, that's a very interesting way of doing it. So, you're going to add all the fives. So, add the groups of fives first. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Yes. 34, yes. 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. 39. I didn't think that you would think of that method of adding together. Mm -hmm. Very good. What other method could we have used? We could have just, just added all of these. So should we just check that and see if we get the same amount, 39? Okay. So... 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16... 17, mm -hmm. 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, mm -hmm. 26, 27, 28, 29, and 10, 20, 20, so 39. So 39. And can I just say that you've just shown us why doing tallies can be easier? Yeah. Because when you added them, in added the groups of fives first that yeah. made the checking a lot simpler yes okay so that comes to the end of the lesson today hope you enjoyed the video and if you did subscribe now bye bye now we have some practice questions for you to try when you're ready pause the video and have a go when you're finished and ready for the answers press play